Good evening everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to make an infographic chart in After Effects. We will do it step by step, to understand the technique. Let's get started. We create a new composition. We give a name. Dimensions Full HD, and 5 seconds. We enable Title Action Safe. Create a new shape layer. Press Enter. And give a name. Go to Shape Layer Settings. And add Rectangle, and Fill. Go to Fill and Change Color. Go to Rectangle Path and Resize. and move it down, until it gets to the line. And we grow it up, to catch the two vertical lines. Easy tools very good and useful script, I will give you the link to the description to download. Nice. Now we select the text tool. And we write the initials from the Adobe programs. We go to Windows, and we select a line. And we align it exactly in the middle of the composition. Now, let's go and lock the two layers. We choose the rectangle tools, we add a color of our choice. And we create a rectangle. and we bring it exactly where we want it. Press Enter, a given name. Now you have to copy it as the words are. Press Ctrl D, and move it wherever we want. Press Ctrl D. I'll do it quickly, so we don't waste time. Select all with the shift, go to Easy Tools, and move the anchor point. Now we need to change the colors in the rectangles, I will give you the description below, the color codes, we will copy paste the codes. We can hide the layers, that we don't need right now.
Now we have to set the percents. Select the text tool. Type 0. Go to Effects, and Expression Control, and select Slider Control. Go to Text Settings. Press Alt Click. And copy paste the expression. Perfect. Select text and press Ctrl D and move it exactly where we want. After we made it, now we have to do the animation. We open all the layers, and we go to the line. We press S to show the scale, and we go 10 frames in front and we put a keyframe. We go 10 frames back and we do scale 0. We select all keyframes. Right click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9. Now we go to text. We press T to open the opacity. We go 5 frames back. And we put a keyframe, and we do 0. We go 10 frames in front, and we do 100%. We select all keyframes, right-click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9. Press the space to make a RAM preview. We select all the bar layers and press S to open the scale and press a keyframe uncheck the icon to change the scale to Y only and set it to 0 move 20 frames forward and move them wherever we want We select all keyframes. Right click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9. Go to the graph editor. Select all the points. And click easy ease. Press the space to make a RAM preview. Perfect. Now we have to do it, and at percents. We select all layers and press P, open the positions, put a keyframe, and move them down.
Move 20 frames forward. And move them above the bars. We select all keyframes. Right click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9, go to the graph editor, select all the points, and click easy ease. Press the space to make a RAM preview. I press Ctrl left arrow, and we hit a frame back, we press T to open the opacity, we put a keyframe, and we do 0, we press Ctrl and right arrow, we hit a frame in front, and we do 100%. We select all keyframes, right click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9. Press the space to make a RAM preview. Press U, open all keyframes, now we have to change rates, go 20 frames back. And all slider controls, set a keyframe, and do 0. Go 20 frames forward. Select all press U, open all keyframes. And we pass a value that matches the bars. We select all keyframes. Right click keyframe assistant, easy ease or F9. Press the space to make a RAM preview. Perfect. Now we have to show each bar, and rate one after the other. We move 5 frames forward. We select all percentages by pressing shift, we press alt square bracket left. We click on layers right click, keyframe assistant. And sequence layer, and then OK. We got 5 seconds. We hit alt square bracket right, and we're ready. We have to do the same with the bars, we select all the bars with the shift. Go 5 frames in front. Press Alt Square Bracket Left. Right click on Layers, Keyframe Assistant, and Sequence Layer, and OK. Go on 5 seconds. We hit Alt Square Bracket Right, and we're ready. Press the space to make a RAM preview. We select all bars, with shift. Right click, and pre-comp and we name it. Go to effects.
stylize and select Glow. Go into Glow Settings, and slightly Glow Sword, and to Radius. And we're ready. We go to the project panel, and we import a photo of our choice. We select it, and we put it down in the composition. We right click it, we make a new solid. We put a name to open the opacity and we relax a little. We are ready. Press the space to make a RAM preview. This is the basic technique. In the coming days, we will make more sophisticated infographic charts. Thanks for watching me, if you liked my video subscribe to my channel, bye.